Now, meteorologist Jamie Jarosik and your Storm Team 2 forecast. And all of the Miami Valley is back to dry weather after some overnight rain came through. It is 63 degrees, a nice mild start to the day, lots of clouds. And we are going to see on and off showers. So lunchtime, it's likely we're going to see some rain in the area. We'll be up near 68. And then 5 o'clock, maybe some breaks in the rain at that time. 74, still the chance, though, of something spotty even into the evening. We'll be down to 71 through 7 o'clock. And it will be breezy as the day goes on. Winds haven't been too bad this morning between 5 and 10, but they'll increase for the afternoon. It is 60. 63 with a dew point of 62. So we've got a lot of low level moisture, and that visibility has dropped to six miles. We'll keep an eye on that. Just some light fog out there right now. It's 62 in Richmond and Eaton, 62 also in Springfield. And then Urbana's a little cooler at 59 degrees. It's 60 up towards Bell Fountain and 61 in Piqua. A nice mild morning, pretty much area wide. A wide view, we have a warm front down to the south. And on the other side of that boundary, it's upper 60s, Lexington, Evansville down to Paducah. And that's all going to lift into the Miami Valley today. A very warm day in the forecast as we get into the 70s ahead of a strong storm system. And that system is sitting off to the west. It is going to bring us the chance of unsettled weather throughout the week. You can see it right now. Back in Oklahoma, it's going to be a slow mover as it progresses eastward. Uh, so tomorrow looks to be our best day of rain. And as the system just sort of sits over us Wednesday and Thursday, each day as we heat up in those afternoon hours, we'll most likely see the best chance of rain occur then. Here's our satellite radar loop showing the overnight rain lifting to the northeast, but check out the conditions to the southwest. There are more scattered showers. It's very unsettled, so all of that will continue to lift in. Even if it's not raining where you are right now and you're heading out, take along the umbrella because it's likely we're going to see some more rain through the day. Future track shows some rain in the area as we head towards that 9 o'clock hour this morning, and then we'll continue to see that chance right through lunchtime and for the drive home at 5. Still a few showers possible, but also a lot of dry weather at that time. Any rain chance tapers off a little bit tonight. We will have a lot of dry weather, but then we get into tomorrow and we start to see it increase significantly. In the morning, we'll see rain spreading in and it will overspread all of the Miami Valley as we head towards lunchtime and beyond. So get ready for tomorrow, probably the wettest day of the week. 75 today, lots of clouds, but breezy with the mild temperatures and then those scattered showers at any time. Tonight, we're going to drop down to 62. It'll still be nice and mild, but a slight chance of a spotty shower, otherwise, just just mostly cloudy. And then showers and thunderstorms likely tomorrow. Winds pick up even more. It's going to be a windy day. South wind 15 to 25 with a high near 70. A little bit cooler on your Storm Team 2 seven day forecast for Wednesday, Thursday. We'll be into the mid and low 60s during that time frame. And then over the weekend, we dry out just in time with temperatures pretty pleasant in the low 60s and lows kind of chilly getting down into the 40s.